My sweet goats, do I have a story for you? It is a very, very... Uh, it's a gift of a story, honestly. You're gonna you're gonna hear it and you'll be like, "Fuck, I know this about this guy." Yeah, and then you'll be able to, you'll tell someone about it. You'll be like, "Yo, I heard about this guy on the internet. This fucking guy, he did this." I'll be a talking point in a dinner conversation at some point. I'm pretty sure after you hear this story, it'll be fun. It'll be fun. You know why not? Why not? I've provided you some material to bring home to your family, and that's and that's wonderful, right? Okay. When I was 12, I was I was I was coming. I was getting to this point where I was like, "Whoa, whoa, whoa." I feel things. I feel. Uh, I feel. I feel something in my in my pants in PP Pee -Pee City. PP Pee -Pee City has some shit going on. There's so there's a party happening there. Okay, and this party is kind of uncontrollable. And I'm just like, fuck. I gotta do something about this. So I didn't really have much material, you know, at, at the age of 12 or whatever. I don't remember the exact age. I could have been 12 or 13. Doesn't really matter because uh, it's not really a just not much of a big big difference between 12 and 13. Honestly, it's fucking marginal, marginal. Uh, and, uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm trying to think about what the fuck I was just talking about before. I, I fucking do this all the time. I do this all the fucking time, okay? I start talking about something and I'm like, and then I stop and I'm like, wait a minute, what the fuck was I just talking about? Ridiculous. Anyway, I remember now. Okay, it's very simple. I wanted to masturbate as, as, as a kid and so I didn't have any access to any material and uh, there was no magazines around or anything like that. It was literally just like this TV in my living room and my parents weren't at home. Nobody was at home. Nobody was at home and uh, it was really good. I was just alone in, in the house. And so uh, I turn on the TV and I go to the French news station. We had like three channels. I think it was channel 10 or something. That was the French one. And, uh, and there was a really hot news anchor. I don't even know her name. I just saw her one time and I was like, wow, she's hot. She's real hot. And so I, I dropped my pants. I literally got out of my pants, okay? I didn't just, I didn't just like drop my pants. I took off my pants, then took off my underwear. Underwear. <laughs> I took off my underwear and I just stood there in front of the TV, rubbing my dick on the TV whenever this lady showed up. And I was like, yeah. <laughs> I don't know if I was like I don't know if I was like yeah, but I was pretty much trying to get I was trying to get something going on there. I was like so fucking I was like just so horny, and uh, and then suddenly you know I hear the fucking door like the door unlock and I'm like holy shit my fucking dad is home. So I run from the living room into the bathroom and then I hit wait for my dad to open the door and come in. I hear his boots and all that stuff, and I flush the toilet and I get out and I walk. <laughs> <laughs> and I walk out just just completely naked just completely naked towards my dad So my dad hears the toilet flush and he sees me coming down the fucking out into the kitchen like completely just naked And he and he looks into the living room and he sees my underwear in one area my pants in another area And he's like what the fuck were you doing? He's like what were you fucking doing dude? What was going on there? So what happened you like uh, you just dropped your pants decided to go to the fucking bathroom that way You didn't want to just bring the pants to the bathroom and I was just like, yeah, I know, I just felt like it. I, I don't know what happened. I just had to do it. And my dad looks over and there's like this hot fucking news anchor on TV. So my dad just like smiles and he's just like, okay, okay, man. All right. All right. And then he just dropped it. My dad didn't do anything. He just fucking dropped it. Oh man, that was a good one. That was a good fucking story. That was a real fun story. A little bit of a, little bit of a insight into the life of Bunty King. That was it. It just, it was just a, a silly fucking moment. Hormonal kid sees a hot news lady on fucking TV and says, you know what, I'm gonna take off my pants. I'm gonna take off my pants and my underwear and just leave it here and then stand in front of the fucking TV and just rub my dick all over it. Sick. Sick move, young Bunty. Sick move. And that's it, my sweet goats. Look, I, I hope that you enjoyed this story. I hope that it brought a smile to your face and I, I hope that it made you laugh. Uh, if you want to see more of me, you can always go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And uh, if you want to see me, Immediately, you make sure you hit that bell icon so you stay notified. Uh, and of course, if you did enjoy, just in general, just want to leave a like. Go ahead and leave a like, leave a comment, say hello, say whatever. Uh, share this with a friend. Do whatever you wish. Do whatever you wish. You want to masturbate to this fucking video? You can masturbate to this video. I don't care. Have a good one. Take it easy. I will see you real, real soon. My sweet, sweet goats. Bye.